goalkeeper. And uh, at the back, Mascherano's playing in its centre half. I can sort of half understand that as well because of the problems with Puyol, who's on the bench tonight. And maybe there's not an awful lot to choose between them, and they're confident. Four testimony to that because you can see. Oh. Oh, in fact, Alonso played it in. It was a disguise on that. Ramos with a chance. Peels for handball against Adriano. Clever Nothing doing kick. for Real Madrid. Clever free kick, Kevin. That good disguise. Everyone expected the shot. There's the ball. It's hit into his side. It's not even near it. Similar to the one at the other end. The referee at least is consistent. Undiana Malenko. Sergio Ramos didn't try to get out of the way. And he's given a free kick for exactly the same offence as at the other end. Well, it was carbon copy, wasn't it? Yeah. Madrid tonight. Ronaldo ostensibly playing that role, but he'll drift and there'll be an onus on Mesut Ozil to slide into that gap. Eminently capable of doing that, the German international. It's just out of play. I, I thought Ozil and Adebayor both made a big impression when they came on in the last 15 minutes. And you know, I thought there was a little bit of complacency from Barcelona. They had the game won, didn't really need to do an awful lot, and they were a little bit complacent for me. Drops nicely onto the right foot of Xavi. Villa will give chase, very much on familiar territory. David Villa, once of Valencia. Sergio Ramos is no stranger to fouls and yellow cards and sending offs. He's up way too early, way too early. His timing's totally wrong and he lands on top of David Villa. What did David Villa do wrong there to be penalised? Now, oh, Mascherano lost the flight of that initially and just 96 goals. Forward by Iniesta. Marcelo's challenge. Villa Mascherano. Here's Arbeloa. Teases one in and Cadero was showing interest in that one. Yes. And it shows. PK cut out easily by Carvalho. Beating again there of Xabi Alonso and Busquets. With Messi. And he and David Villa and Messi will interchange right throughout the game. And the pressing starting to come. Eventually poked forward by... Looks for David Villa, Marcelo with an important touch. Was David Villa was lurking with danger behind him. Started slow. Cavalio can't prevent the corner. I was nearly going to say he's the oldest player. Villa's like he's got a team for the Copa del Rey and he's trying to be loyal. And this is taken quite for Xavi. Let's see what he was trying to do. Pick out that ghosting run from Busquets. Two or three kick, really. Both these sides' standards, their quality's been fluency. You won't want Barcelona to get, get the ball and do what they do best, which is... Marcelo. Di Maria on his outside. Offside against Villa. The late flag, I have to say. Yes. Official on the far side has been absolutely spot on every time and he's got that one. Good challenge by Arbeloa. Here's Ronaldo. Xavi Alonso. Marcelo. Feed up Marcelo. Do you know they've been the dominant force in this game for me so far around Madrid? They've they've looked a lot more positive. And they've got forward to good effect. But the final balls let them down, Kevin. You know, the ball that's let them down are the final shot and goal, and they have to start making these opportunities. Right. Early ball seeks out the run of uh, Pedro. Checked. I think it was David Villa, and then he gets involved with Arbeloa. This is a powder keg, isn't it? The referee needs to get in between them here. Casillas looking to act as peacemaker. Well, there was an angry reaction there from David Villa after he was challenged by Arbeloa. Well, he's given the free kick, but what's he going to do for the actions of Arbeloa? One, pulling him up off the ground. David Villa certainly raised his arms, but he has won the ball in the air. And again, it's so difficult for the referee.
gear and create chances. They won't be as lenient in front of goal. That's a poor touch from Pedro. But Barcelona haven't. Neatly done by Marcelo, onside of Ronaldo. Oh, he looked onside. Late flag. I'd like to see it again, it was close, Kevin. Certainly very close. And as he goes, he's onside. I think Adriano played him on. PK looking for Pedro. Oh, he's given a free kick to the other way for a challenge. And another angry reaction, this time Pedro on Carvalho. Who's getting it? Is it Pedro? Or no, it's... Pedro. A yellow card for Pedro. He was angry with Carvalho there. Let's see if there was uh, much in this challenge. Oh, he's a little bit late. That's the one thing. I mean, he's... Fed in towards Villa. Well policed by Sergio Ramos. And Carvalho thought there was a little deflection there. Which would have earned his side a goal kick, but Paul Lino. Good tackle. Well done, Marcelo. Is another look like reaching Messi. Valdez with a follow up shot, though. Breaks off. Reading at the Camp Nou reflected very much on Mourinho's selection then. I agree with you, and I felt that Pepe did a brilliant job. He broke up a lot of attacks, and it was negative, but it worked. Sloppy piece of play this time from Gerard Piquet. Arbeloa playing that long ball forward to the run of uh, finding a little pocket of space. Uh, over D. 